sometimes a parent will come to me and tell me, my daughter's not dressing to music. Her skirts are way too short. I'm so embarrassed when I walk down Kingston with her. Um, she doesn't come to the Shabbos table, and if she comes, she's wearing her pajamas. Um, she has no interest in anything that has to do with Yiddishkeit, so I need you to make her more from. Okay, I'm, I'm sending her to you. You have to convince her to be more excited about Tyrannosaurus. And then I do a little digging, and I find out that their daughter is depressed, or she has severe anxiety, or she has a learning disability and hasn't succeeded in school in years. And I tell the parents, there is a road your daughter must travel. The road is healthy, happy, slim. And you can't reverse the order. Just like when you want to drive to Rhode Island, you can't drive through Providence first and then Waterbury, Connecticut. You have to go through Waterbury, Connecticut and keep going up the I-95 to get to Providence. You can't change the order. The order is healthy, happy, slim. And if you address the mental, physical, emotional health issues first, then the child has a chance to be happy. And if you help the child find reasons to be happy, ways to be happy, make the home a happier place to be, put her in a school environment where she's happier, then she will open her heart to the ideas of being more engaged with her age